Good morning, y'all. Anthony Mitchell here. All right, like, subscribe, comment, and share. Just drop the girlfriend off of work and look at this. The front window cracked. That's why you have insurance. That's why you pay attention to what you're doing. And you have proper protection. Because no matter what you're doing, y'all, it don't matter if it's life insurance, health insurance, auto insurance, a financial protection plan, make sure you have the proper protection in place to take care of yourself. The most people don't think about the unexpected. Because things happen every single day in your life, especially when you don't have control over your life, like I said yesterday. Control what you can control, what you can control your health, you can control your wealth, you can control your time. You have the ability to control all those. But unexpected stuff like a broken window, you have no control over. Um, someone driving you crazy and something happened, you got no control over that. So don't worry about stuff like that. And just set yourself to be able to adapt to it when it happens. Now, let me reiterate that. You have control of your time, your money, and your, um, your health. You have control over all that. Most people don't because they give control over just uh, an employer who controls their schedule, controls how much money they're going to be making. And they don't take care of their health because their employee or employer takes up all the time so they don't have time to work out. But you have the ability to take control. Start a home-based networking business. Create residual income that keeps coming in whether you're working or not. Take ownership of your life. Stop just going through the motions and having one source of income. If you rely on one stream of income for the rest of your life, you're going to be constantly relying on that stream of income. It's not very fun to only have one source of income. It's not very fun to have someone else telling you what to do, where to be, and how much you're worth. It's not. Like I said, I don't have a job. I have a home-based networking business. I'm a member of online one of shopping club that pays me for helping them market their business. I get paid for doing surveys. I get paid for delivering vehicles. Like I could have took a two hundred dollar trip, a nine hour trip. I could have accepted it last night, but I didn't because mm, would have flown, went up to Venice and Fort Worth and go to Florida. About a nine and a half hour trip. The Moose and Eagles around with me, two hundred dollars. So that's something you don't need a job in order to make money in order to pay your bills. There's a million different ways you can make, you can go earn money. So if you are just hell bent on trading your time for money, you don't need a job to do that. You can do surveys, you can do the gig economy, you can do whatever you want. And right now I just picked up a Chick-fil-A delivery, about to drop it off, then I gotta go pick up a Perkins delivery and drop it off. Then make it back to the apartment hopefully. <sighs> Have some breakfast. Well I had some bacon so far, but finish my breakfast since my morning routine because I still haven't done my meditation and I'm making my video right now and that's about it now I gotta do my McGill Big 3 and I'll not lose out but dude set up your life so you have choices if you don't have the choice of what you want to do you don't have the choice to take your girlfriend to work because her car is so broken you don't have the choice to make sure your stepkids get on the bus I, what are you doing? Most people have to negotiate with their jobs to try to get leeway for showing up late. Like my girlfriend, she shows up. She's supposed to be there at 7 every morning, but because the little man gets to get on the bus at like 7 or 6.40, she's never at work by 7. She's there by 7, 10, 7, 15. But they understand, so they allow her to come in 10, 15 minutes late because of her son and their short staff. But if it was back in the day, when your job actually cared that like you had to be very proficient on time. But since all this COVID and all this crap, all this unemployment people and nobody wants to work, people are having leeway. But you don't need leeway, y'all. Set up your life so you have control. Start a home-based networking business. Create residual passive income. And own your life, y'all. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. Y'all be great.